the air back on. <laughs> Maybe so. Well, we've got a cool night ahead, that's for sure. Out there today, the temperatures stayed cooler than normal, and boy, the clouds came and went, didn't they? Cleared out kind of nicely across the Blues Lake area. Temperatures out there today managed to make it just up close to 80. At 79 degrees, 88 is our normal high. Right now, we're at 67 degrees in Winston-Salem. Still have a light east wind, still have really low dew points. We'll take it. Temperatures are in the mid to upper 60s all across the area. 63 already in Reedsville, so they're on their way down. 64 in North Wilkesboro and 66 in Yakinville. Yes, this morning there was a little bit of rain down east, eastern part of the triad. Since then, we haven't seen hardly anything across the area. Light rain, about a tenth of an inch to a quarter of an inch. Guilford, Alamance, Randolph counties. Here's where the real heavy rain was. Just missed us to the east. And really, that's where most of the heavy rain is going to stay because today we had our best chance of catching some of this rain, at least across our area. So as it is down east, I anticipate that it will stay there. So our rain chances are very limited. We're going to start off cool in the morning, though. 63 degrees, partly cloudy to mostly sunny tomorrow. We get up to about 81. I do think there's a small rain chance for spotty shower eastern triad tomorrow. Northeast winds 5 to 10 miles an hour, so that onshore flow continues, and that will keep us cool. High of 80 in our foothill communities like Yakinville and Mount Airy, mostly sunny. Going to keep the foothills dry. For the mountains, because we do have that easterly wind, I think some of that moisture could be pushed up against the mountains, and we could get an upslope shower or two. So I've got a 20% chance in for late day. High temperature 77, but look at that morning start at 56 degrees. We've got waves of low pressure, yeah, all the way back to Texas. So we'll kind of track those along the front. But it does look like that avenue in the sky is going to stay put. A little trough of low pressure just to our west may help generate an isolated shower or two in the mountains. Everybody across the eastern half of the nation really enjoying these cooler than normal temperatures. So we've got a high of 81 tomorrow, 84 Thursday, mid 80s Friday and Saturday. Precipitation chances, they're going to stay low. 20% tomorrow, dry Thursday, maybe bumping it up a little bit by Saturday. Here's the map for tomorrow. Rain mostly to the east. Then for Thursday afternoon, rain again east and west, but not really across central North and South Carolina. Friday, again, rain east, rain west, not much in the middle. I do think we kind of narrow or close that gap a little bit by Saturday. So I did bring that rain chance Saturday in just a little bit higher. And notice, too, that by Sunday, we've got temperatures that are going to be close to 90 degrees again. So if you're planning for this week, I think pretty good to get outdoors in the morning. It'll be nice for exercise. Highs only in the mid 80s in the afternoon. We do start to get a little steamier by the end of the weekend.